In this episode, we'll be taking a look at the best and latest helicopters engineered by the well-trusted aircraft brand, Sikorsky. We have an amazing list of reasons why they deserve each spot, so stay with us until the end to know which helicopter models can carry you through the war zone safely and in great command. Introduced through the release of the first practical helicopter in 1939 by head figure Igor I. Sikorsky, the Sikorsky helicopter brand outspaced the test of time to become one of the world's giants in the helicopter industry. The company put significance in rotorcrafts that assist people devastated by natural phenomena and fighting conditions during the war. The company has been a part of creating rotary wing and military aircraft for 40 nations, including the United States of America. Worldwide, the brand now has its fingerprints on countless civilian and military aviation projects, just as Sikorsky envisioned. For this episode, we'll discover some of the most current and sought-after Sikorsky helicopters that dominate the market. This is Roxanne, and you're watching Aviation Federation, sharing with you exciting information about the latest and greatest in aviation and beyond. At number 5, we have the Sikorsky S-76D. With continuous innovation and improvement for 30 years, the S-76D remained one of the best in its field. It now utilizes the new Pratt & Whitney Canada PW210S twin engine that can go in a maximum of 155 knots of cruise speed. It can accommodate 5 to 8 passengers with a spacious cabin. Having no load, it weighs 6,963 pounds and can carry 4,912 pounds of weight. The Sikorsky S-76D fits more than just one specialization. It is deployed to deliver executive transportation, emergency, and other services. Furthermore, it now includes next-generation Thales Top Deck and a Bendix King Traffic Collision Avoidance System. Ten countries now relied on the S-76D to fly for their chief executive's mission. That is all because of more than 7.5 million hours of smooth and secure flight. The S-76D costs around 50 million US dollars. At number 4, we have the Sikorsky Firehawk. Designed for fire extinguishing, the Firehawk is yet another star in the Sikorsky helicopter lineup. It is generated by T700GE 701D engines and can fly at a maximum cruise speed of 145 knots. It can accommodate 13 passengers and crew. At a standard day sea level, it has a gross weight of 22,000 pounds. The Sikorsky Firehawk offers great maneuverability and payload for needed storage. It has the ability to hold 40% more water than its competition, a 3,785-liter water capacity, and a 114-liter foam tank. It can be filled up rapidly, reaching a time of 60 seconds. The cabin can also be configured with ease for faster change to accord with necessity. The price of Sikorsky Firehawk is around 26 million US dollars. At number 3, we have the Sikorsky S92. Since 2004, the S92 have been rescuing lives and became one of the most trusted rescue helicopters. Its latest innovation included two General Electric CT788 turboshaft engines that have a maximum cruise speed of 151 knots. It has 19 troop sitting capacity and two crew member places. In addition, it has a total gross weight of 26,500 pounds.
The Sikorsky S92 is perfect for crowded point-to-point -point passenger transportation. It just celebrated its 2 million flight hours recorded last July. Being a standard for rescue helicopters, it has collected several aircraft awards including the 2016 Hansen T. Jensen Award for Outstanding Rotorcraft Safety Record. Additionally, it includes numerous optional pieces of equipment to help boost rescue operations and crew comfort. The price of the S92 is around 27 million US dollars. At number 2, we have the Sikorsky HH-60 Combat Rescue Helicopter. The U.S. Air Force relies heavily on the HH-60 in its military and rescue operations. It is powered by two GET-700 GE-701D turboshaft engines that can run at 159 knots of maximum cruise speed. It can bear 12 troops at the cabin and 6 crews for the helicopter and the equipment included. Moreover, it has 22,500 pounds of gross weight. It is on the highest tier among survivability as extensive upgrades attached to it made it endure even the toughest combat environments. It also features weapon systems such as the crew served and fixed forward 7.62 mm and .50 caliber weapon systems. Communication and navigation are given emphasis as well, highlighted by the five ARC-210 radios with PLS and G-Voice. Aside from that, it also has various storage for baggage and a 660-gallon fuel tank. The price of the Sikorsky HH-60 is to be announced. Up next, we'll get an exciting look at our top spot. But before then, I'd really appreciate if you could leave us a thumbs up and share your thoughts in the comment section below. At number 1, we have the Lockheed Martin Sikorsky Boeing SB-1 Defiant. Making its entrance on the scene during the Army Aviation Association of America Summit, the SB-1 made an early impression on the audience. It is powered by two Honeywell T-55 engines and can run at a maximum cruise speed of 250 knots on its true airspeed. It can carry a total of 12 fully geared troops in the cabin, holding a four cruise capacity limit, all while having additional space for medical evacuation operations. It has an astonishing gross weight of 30 pounds made to improve its vertical lift. The SB-1 Defiant is one of the Defiant models that Sikorsky has been developing. On its training load test drive, it was able to lift a 5,300 pounds rocket system. It is usually dubbed the first vertical lift for its extreme load management and carrying prowess. It is also built on X2 technology, which includes an advanced drive system, fly-by wire flight controls, and advanced rigid rotor system. The price of the SB-1 Defiant is to be announced. So, what do you think about the technical specifications of each helicopter? What do you think is better? The Sikorsky helicopters that specialize in a highly specific purpose or those that can be used for several missions or operations. Let us hear your thoughts by dropping a comment down below. Once again, this is Rixan, and you're watching Aviation Federation. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon to keep up to date with our latest videos. Thank you for watching and fly safe!